happy homecoming for South Carolina as they take down Dayton 65-55. The Gamecocks lost a couple of games in Vancouver. A good trip home for Dawn Staley. Hello, everybody. Birch Antley along with Andrea Carter here in Columbia as we recap this game for you. And for South Carolina, the message was clear. Rebound the basketball, especially on the offensive glass, and make sure that you play Gamecock defense. South Carolina in the first half, trailed by 13, tied the game up halftime, and then South Carolina in the second half used that defense and rebounding the basketball on the offensive boards to pull away from Dayton. And I think defense came up huge, especially in the second half and in the fourth quarter. Held Dayton to only four points in the fourth quarter. They got stops when they needed it, and they were able to secure the win. And a player coming up huge for South Carolina, Ty Harris. A season-high 24 points here tonight for the guard from Indiana, and Ty Harris got it done defensively as well. She was causing havoc and numerous times just going coast to coast. And I think Taisha Harris came up huge for her team. They needed her. They were down in the first half. Her leadership and really her ability to put the ball in the basket. Coach Staley said, we don't want her to defer. We want her to score. We want her to be aggressive. And she did exactly that. And South Carolina getting 22 points from their bench players. And I think South Carolina, if you look at their team, they're all, they all have new identities. They all have new roles. So Taisha Harris leading the team, everyone else stepping up, stepping into their role, playing solid, help them get the win. Eight Gamecocks scoring the basketball tonight, too, for Dawn Staley's squad. Let's take a look at the highlights, and we will start with South Carolina's Taisha Harris. And Ty Harris really is the story of the game. We talked about defense and rebounding, but she got it done on the offensive end as well, getting in the right place at the right time. What I really liked was her attack mentality, whether on half-court offense, transition offense, she was looking to score. If you didn't get out on her, she was putting it up, and for tonight, putting it in. And one of the biggest plays from Ty Harris tonight was off the dribble drive when she was able to drive in and cause Chandler, Julia Chandler, the team's leading scorer for Dayton at the time, to foul out with five minutes remaining in this game. And that was a huge play at that point in time. And Carolina wins by 10, 65 to 55, to go to four and three on the season. Dayton drops to two and four. For Andrea Carter in Columbia, I am Birch Antley.